Mayweather talks a lot about hard work and dedication, and that has been the root of this light heavyweight contender getting back to a championship fight. We'll see what he does with it here tonight, Jimmy. He's a grinder, John. And you knew that he would get back here. You knew that he would find a way to put himself right back on the verge of becoming the man. He has seen it before. He has done it. He has been here. He recognizes the knows that the changes necessary were done in the gym. He's ready, prepared, he's sure. He knows in his mind that by the end of the night, and there was a time when this division was top heavy. Now the top 15 is absolutely loaded. He has emerged out of that pack. We'll see if he becomes the new champion. A man who needs no introduction, the Iceman, Chuck Liddell, enters the octagon with his mind set on one thing tonight, that UFC championship belt. So here he is, folks, the undisputed UFC middleweight champion, Alex Pereira. And it is amazing to think, a few years ago, he crossed into mixed martial arts with the lone goal to try to beat Israel Adesanya, gets the title fight, and knocks him out without fight. I mean, he did it in, like, 12 months. The guy didn't take long to become a champion. We knew and heard the stories long before he ever stepped foot in the octagon, which you didn't know, though, that it would translate this well. This guy does everything good inside the octagon, but it's the kickbox that separates him and the power that he generates when he throws. What an amazing fighter, Alex Pereira. And he's got heart, he's got cardio. You reference the work ethic, Alex Pereira, the total package, and he remains the hunted at 185 pounds. for this light heavyweight title fight. We send it inside the octagon. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, the Iceman, Chuck Liddell. And now he's the champion, fighting out of the red corner, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC light heavyweight champion of the world, Alex Politan Perea! Herb Dean, third Good man fight. in the octagon Good tonight. Good, Good to have you with us tonight from T-Mobile Arena, the home of the NHL's Vegas Golden Knights and the building in which DC shot some of the MMA world at UFC 226, uh, but this venue will always have a special place. This venue holds a special place in my heart. UFC 226, I became the double champion. This is a fight venue that you should want to compete in. A great arena where you can make history. Tonight, you get your chance. Back to the feet. Side there by the champ. That's a big strike right there. Power strike there. He could be in trouble. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. He doesn't know if he's in the octagon or his mama's out for Thanksgiving. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Knock him out. The fight's done. Oh, you 
land, I land is how we're doing here. All right, so he's landed a few semi uppercuts already, DC. You gotta think he goes back to it. I am almost certain he's gonna go and try to find another one of those. But expect him to really set down and try to make one really count to try to end this fight. Good straight hand there by Padeda. Nicely timed kick to the body for the champion. Well, no denying that he rocked it. Continues to sway with every huge shot being landed. Back and forth we go. Back up, but barely. Look how wobbly he is. Lands a good series of kicks here. Liddell gets caught by that flush straight punch. Nice job by the offense there. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. All right, so we'll see what sort of defensive response ensues here. He's taking a lot of shots upstairs, and the swelling is there to prove it. Got to keep those hands up. He might want to employ a high guard to try to ensure that the guy's not landing on those spots because the swelling's starting now, and it's light. But if he takes many more of these types of shots, it's going to get real bad. Oh, head kick, bang. And he connects with the punch there. Liddell swelling now around that jaw area. We'll see if he can make some adjustments and perhaps defensively raise that guard to prevent any further damage. Final seconds here in round one. Right. Round two straight ahead. All right, there's the end of the round, and what a round it was for him. Two knockdowns there. I'm not sure if the opposite corner's gonna throw in the towel, if the doctor's gonna come in, but he is hurting for certain. I mean, they've gotta look at it, right? They've gotta look at their fighter, and sometimes you have to save your fighter from himself. Right. He's always going to get up. He showed that, but he has been outclassed in round number one. He has to either change something or show his coaches that he is going to do something different, or they can't send him back out there. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we are, early round two. What a beautiful body kick. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Right over the top, right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe Beautiful straight punch there by Pineda. Nice execution on the team. Well, he's really seen. Oh my God, he's hurt. He's hurt. Liddell's strike attempt there is blocked. Three minutes now to go in round two. Oh, no. Back to his feet. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Liddell's oh, in, in a ton of trouble right now. And this is a great fight. These guys are just letting it all hang out. Oh, beautiful jab there. There it is again. Look at that. Oh. That's it. That'll do it. Alex Pereira has done it again. I mean, wow.
the official decision is in. Here is the veteran voice, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 22 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC light heavyweight champion of the world. All right, so it goes into the books as a clean knockout. No T required for Alex Pereira. Just another highlight to add to the reel. Massive power.